Hey everybody, it's Clay and Kondo here for a BHS update for August 20th, 2020, in which past last week and a few couple days ago, I got all the VHS tapes that I ordered from eBay, which I got six VHS tapes for, for this update, which I ordered from eBay, and and which um, I actually did order another VHS tape one day, which was Just the Way You Are, 1984 VHS, but that tape snapped when I rewound it, so the seller gave me a refund, and so I'm going to have to throw that tape away. I guess the seller, I can't send this thing back, because I guess the seller didn't want it, because the seller didn't want broken tape, so that's unfortunate, but I did get some of the other tapes that I ordered, and they're in perfect condition, so yep. Which I got two clamshells and four V8 slipcover tapes for this update that I got from eBay. So yep. So yeah. So anyways, let's get let's go on to the update. First, we're we'll start we're we'll start with two clamshells. Which this first one is a Walt Disney Neon Mickey VHS, the 1985 VHS of the Barefoot Executive. This is a 1971 live action Disney movie with Kurt Russell, Joe Flynn, Harry Morgan, and Wally Cox. I don't really remember what day I got this tape in the mail, but I just don't feel like mentioning the dates that I got these tapes because I don't really remember. This also stars the late Heather North, Alan Hewitt, and Hayden Roke, and this movie also stars John R the late John Ritter in his film debut. This movie looks pretty funny, so I said I hadn't ordered this tape. This is Ray G, and it's 95 minutes. This one's a full rental. Here's a tape of the stick rebel with the tan lid. And this is a full rental from another video. And there's no printing on this tape, so I believe this tape's from 1985. And it has a trailer for... The Journey of Natty Gann at the beginning. So I'm going to sit down and watch the movie sometime because it, it does look pretty funny. And the other clamshell I got is a War Big W Warner clamshell VHS from 1983. And that's Best Friends, a 1982 movie. Starring the late Burt Reynolds, Goldie Hawn, Jessica Tandy, Bernard Hughes... Audra, Audra Linney, Keenan Wynn, and Ron Silver. This is directed by Norm Jumison. Part of the comedy genre. What happens when you marry your best friend? This is another movie I've been wanting to check out for a while because it does look pretty good, so... I'm going to have to sit down and watch this movie sometime. It's Ray P. June's 108 minutes. I got this for, for really got this for really cheap. Got it for like two dollars and plus I think a two dollars and eighty cents for shipping. Big W logo engraved. Stick label and label recorded on a scotch tape. The former off some unknown video store. Now let's get on to the slipcover cases, which the first two are RC Claim Pictures Home Video VHS tapes. This first one's from 1984. The 1984 VHS release of Against All Odds. This is a 1984 movie with Jeff with Rachel Roar, Jeff Bridges, James Woods. Alex K Karras, Karras, Jane Greer, and Richard Rimmark. This is a Columbia Pictures movie. Heard this movie was pretty good, so I decided, had, I decided to order this tape. And back in September of 2019, I did get a VHS tape, VHS release of this movie, which is the 1989 Good Times Home Video VHS release. But however, that tape was was recorded someone recorded the whole tape so I got so I got rid of that so finally got the real thing 
the real VHS that is. This one's an RCA Claim Pictures Home Video VHS release. Rated R and it's 122 minutes. Stick variables. The eleventh, the the eleventh week of 1986. Even though this is a 1984 VHS, so this one's a pretty layer. This one's kind of a reprint. And this other, and this next one's a movie I've seen before, and this is a pretty good one. This is the 1987 VHS release of the Buddy Holly story. This is a 1978 movie from Clone Pictures as well. Stars Gary Busey, Don Stroud, Charles Lawrence Smith, Conrad James, and William Jordan. This is a biopic of Buddy Holly. The long-awaited video release featuring 12 of Buddy Holly's greatest hit songs. Yeah, this is the yeah, this movie was wasn't released on VHS until 1987. This one I got for really cheap on eBay as well. And, and Gary Busey was nominated for an Oscar for this movie in 1978, but that lost to John Voight for Coming Home. Ray PG and it's 113 minutes. Tape with the stick label, the end label. There's no week in Europe on this tape for some odd reason. I have seen this movie before. I remember seeing this movie on the Encore channel back in 2009 or 2010. This is a classic movie. I really enjoyed the Buddy Holly story. And since I got and since I have a copy of this movie, I'm very glad to watch this movie again sometime. Because I do remember liking this movie. And the last two tapes are Paramount tapes, which these two VHS tapes I got in a lot from, which I got these two in a, in a two VHS lot from eBay. This next one's the Nighttime 1 VHS of The War of the Worlds. This is a 19, the 1953 version, and I did, and I did get a VHS copy of this movie at Goodwill, which is the 1980-85 re-release, but that tape snapped, so... Sign so order a VHS a replacement copy on eBay, which comes in a VHS slot, like I said. Which this one's the nighttime one VHS. Stars Gene Barry, Ann Robinson, Les Tremaine, and Les Tremaine. Copyright 1952, even though this movie was released in 1953. And this is not rated, and it's 85 minutes. As you can see, this is a Columbia House copy. The labels say Nighttime 5. The 12th week of 1995, and this VHS actually has the same master as the 1980 VHS because it has the first has the first version of the Acid Trip Warren screen at the beginning, then the movie's Paramount logo, so, so they actually used the tape master from 1980, even though this is a Nighttime 1 VHS, so that's pretty interesting. I heard this is supposed to be a classic movie, so so I had to go ahead and order this and give this a watch some time and here's the last speech just for something which this is the other tape I was in that lot with War of the Worlds which this is a 19 
1981 VHS release of When Worlds Collide. This is a 1951 movie with Barbara Rush, Richard Dare, and Peter Hansen. And this and War of the Worlds produced by George Powell, so I guess that's why it came in a lot. And this is another movie I've been curious about, so I decided to pick it up as well for the lot. This is only 80, this is 81 minutes. Here's a tape of the stick label, the end label. Formal from Cooper's video by Cooper Ventures. The, the print off the 10th week of 1986, so this one's a layer print in. So yeah, grab to sit down and watch the movie sometime. And that's it for my VHS update for August 20th, 2020. Hope you like this video and see you guys later.